well hi guys and welcome back to my channel if you are new here my name is Hulda Pokolo and if you are a returning subscriber thank you guys so much for returning and uh well in today's video as per topic y'all can see what i'm gonna do i'm gonna change my career guys i'm gonna become an electrical engineer today because we are doing this ourselves well what i did is i bought my parents a fire stick and i bought alexa so for those that do not know what a fire stick is and i'll show you how it operates later it actually makes your dumb tv smart <laughs> if that makes sense okay so what happened is my parents have that old it's not that old it's a flat screen tv yes but it's not a smart tv where you can go on youtube watch netflix you do do all those smart things so this fire stick does the magic and i'm gonna show you guys later please continue watching if you want to see how this works and then alexa alexa is a smart device i mean we all know what alexa is right we see it in the movies right so i'm gonna install alexa and what i did is oh so i also bought a smart switch um so we'll be able to connect alexa to the smart switch and alexa to the tv we can tell alexa to you know play a movie we can tell alexa to switch on the lights and whatsoever so i'm gonna do that quickly install that while my parents are not here and then we can surprise them so let's do that well what we do have is let me just turn the camera and hope you guys will see me properly i'm gonna change this plug and put in the new plug the smart 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 switch um this is how the smart switch looks like um i'm gonna change this <laughs> don't ask me how we'll see how we'll do it now and then we're gonna install alexa and uh yeah we'll see how that goes so if you want to see how that ends and if we are not gonna burn <laughs> let's go ahead and do that okay so first things first i already switched on switched off the main socket uh so all the lights are off the, there's no power so i'm gonna continue and take this out oh that was easy The one is out so we're gonna try and okay guys i don't know anything about electricity né? but i read i read and i also asked for help so let's do that quickly and see if it's gonna work um so this is how this one comes this is where i need to connect and i think oh okay cool first things first what else am i supposed to do here okay i think this one opens Sorry, I think this one opens here. Oops, before I break things. Okay, so I'm supposed to open this one because this is where. Oh, hold up, color. What am I supposed to do? Press it. <gasps> oh, okay, yeah. This is it. So, okay, this is where I need to connect. This is where we see if we are going to burn this house or we are still going to be alive. Um <laughs> hold up a color, what are you doing? Okay, I know my dad can do this and he will kill me if he finds me at anywhere close to these sockets. Oh you guys you guys can see me. He will kill me if he finds me anywhere close to these plugs. But he will not kill me if he finds it working. And I'll be dead by the way if it's <laughs> if it doesn't happen. To work okay so first things first i think this one here wazala wajala i want you guys can see me it's a bit hard to okay the sun is a bit against us but yeah oops let's quickly do this and i quickly want to do it well they're not here because my dad will kill me. Surely kill me. Number one, I don't know anything about electricity. Number two, I feel, I think this is like a DIY. Please don't try this at home. Please do call an electrician. But if I happen to fix this, y'all can call me. Y'all can call me to fix for you guys. Because, hello, we are doing this. 
Okay. Uh, don't ask me which wire is which, ne? I just managed to happen to know. I can't keep the tripod higher. I was gonna show you guys. I'll show you guys after I'm done where I exactly put it. I'm not. I'm not your normal girl, okay? I'm not. That's <laughs> somebody came. This one is a bit tight. Okay. Okay. I think it's so um so this socket only can operate for two lights, ne? Um so they here usually it switches off the one outside and the one light inside so um it will only connect to this two so if you wanna like connect your whole house you obviously need to buy more of the sockets and i only bought one because i didn't have money but um in the future we'll be able to buy a lot more items to connect to alexa in terms of you know you can even close your curtains there's a lot of things you can do with alexa um you just need to obviously buy the things. Uh -huh. Okay, cool. Almost done here. Okay. Um, let me show you else. Uh -huh. So that's how I connected them. I hope it's right. Uh, we're going to take a chance now and switch it on by the main socket and see if the lights are going to go on, right? Yeah, let's do that. Uh, let me be back. Y'all should tell me if it's going to go on or not. I'm quickly going to switch it on by the main socket and hopefully I come back. Otherwise, if I don't, it means I'm choked. baby can y'all see that it's on i'm so excited okay before i touch it i'm going to switch it off again so that i can close up the whole thing just wanted to see if it's working okay let's move on so i will close this guy uh, is it like this yeah i'll close this guy Ooh. i don't want anyone to find me here Especially not my bed. Uh, oh, by the way, you will need to install two apps on your phone. Um, and I'll show you guys shortly. Let me just close this thing quickly. It's giving me... Uh, come on, close. Because I just need to close the cap, which is not a problem if it's not closed. Anyways. Oh, it's this wire here. Yeah. Call me in oh oh my battery. Call me engineer. <laughs> ah God. Why are you give oh you are not tight enough. Is that why you're not closing? Okay guys, this is just a a cap. It's just a closing cap. It's not going on. I don't know why. I wanna quickly finish. I can take this off now. Uh, oh no. This is not what we have to do. What we have to do is close this guy here. We will close this guy. So I need to push these guys inside. Close this. These wires are so tight though. Okay. Close that. And.
Okay, let me just move you guys a little bit. The sun is a little bit against us, but y'all can see, right? Okay, so I just need to close the bottom. But this is the right one. Why am I struggling the whole time? Oh. Okay. Oh, I think it's too in. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I closed it too tight. The hole was not, you know. Uh, designed for this much. I think it's a small. It's a bit small, like a few inches. That's why we will have this on the side. Uh, hopefully, my dad can close it up with something. Otherwise, we can stay like that. I think it's still too deep. it's closed and then not you then we will close it off with this guy so this guy needs to connect here oopsie wash okay i think it is time to test it again i will be able to to switch the inside light out off and on and the one outside and then when my dad comes i will connect um the smart switch to his phone and alexa and then we'll be able to comment alexa what to do you know what i'm saying okay come on. Oh, it's on. You guys can't see because there's light. You all won't see because there's light. But if you check closely, can you see? Yeah, can you see? It's on. Okay, so what we'll be able to do now is switch on. Oh, now I need to know which one is for the outside and which one is for the inside. I'll be able to. That should be for the outside. Yeah. No. Why? Oh. oh the light is on. Okay, the light is on. Yeah, can you see? So this is the inside. Can you see? Let me show you else. Okay, so that's the light for the inside. I'm gonna switch it on. Wash. Wajala wajala motuli. Okay, and I'm gonna switch it off. Okay, so first things first, we are done. We managed to be able to switch it on and off manually. Y'all can see, right? I'll do it again when the when it's a little bit dark. Then you'll see. So now, so now we're just gonna wait for my dad to come back, for my father to come back, so that we connect the plug to his phone, the smart switch to his phone, and Alexa, and then. Uh, We'll be able now to tell Alexa what to do. All right. I'll continue later when he's home. As long as this, the, the, the technical part is done, the others, it's, it's, it should be simple and easy. So, later. Okay, guys. So, um, I'm back. Uh, sorry. <laughs> okay, anyways. Now, uh, like I said, you're supposed to connect your switch to the Wi-Fi, right? um so what you have to do is um you press one of the buttons for a very long like maybe three seconds and then the wi-fi um light will start flickering once it starts flickering you um you need to download iwi link download iwi link on your phone i'll show you guys now so these are the three i hope you can see okay so these are the three apps that you need to download. You need to download Ewe Link, Amazon, Alexa, and Spotify. All right. So once you s install your your plug, you come to your Ewe Link app. Come on, open. 
okay i hope you can see let's get it to a point where we can see we can see let me reduce the light maybe it will make things better okay once you open your iwi link app you need to press at this plus button and then it will be it will say quick pairing once you open it it will now show um your two switches once you um because i already did it i'm just explaining and then you connect the switches to the wi-fi password and then you just put in your password so which i already did so then now i'm then able to um control i'm able to control the switch with my phone which um i hope you can see okay so these are my two switches i have channel one and channel two channel one if you can see outside that it is on let me just open the door okay this is the outside okay so this is the outside so if i say channel one off the living room is off i'll show you guys that's the living room i'll say channel one here i will switch it on and then it switches on if i say this it switches off so we have three options so we'll be able to switch it off with the phone able to switch it off on the socket itself and able to switch it off by commanding alexa to do so so that is the outside so that is the outside i'll be able to switch it off with pressing this button come on that's the button for outside channel two and then i switch it on the inside i can switch it on and off alternatively i can switch it on and off by pressing this button that's the inside that's the outside uh, switching it off that's the outside switching it off that's the outside switching it on all right so we have connected the switch to the wi-fi we have installed the switch and connected it to the wi-fi and we can con control the lights with these two devices okay let's move on okay so we have connected our smart switch to the wi-fi what we now need to do also is connect alexa to the wi-fi so for those that do not know what alexa or how alexa looks like this is alexa and to connect alexa to the wi-fi you will need to press this button maintain this button for two three seconds and then alexa will be in a ready to pair mode or ready to connect mode and then once you do that you now take your phone um okay this is better and then you go not in iwi link we go to alexa remember i said you need to download three apps you need to download iwi link amazon alexa and spotify so <clears throat> we are now going to go into alexa once you go into alexa you press more you press more you go to alexa your set was released on november 6, come on alexa stop I just connected her. So you just switch. You just plug her, eh? okay? And then you, we were, where were we? We put, you press more, and then you go to, um, where am I? Oh, sorry, Alexa just confused me. Okay, you press more. You go to settings, device and settings. Once you do that, you press to how you named your device. Ours is Arrestus Echo Dot. You just click on that. And then you'll be able to connect to the Wi-Fi. Your Wi-Fi name should appear down here and you'll be able to connect it and put in your password. What you can also do is uh, connect to the Bluetooth. So you can connect your phone to Alexa and then you can use Alexa as a Bluetooth speaker. So you can play music, you can skip uh, music. Um, you can literally use her as a speaker. And how you do that, you just press the plus button there and then you can pair your device. Alternatively, you can tell Alexa to, uh, to connect to um, your device if you know the Bluetooth name. For instance, here you can see is Alexa is currently connected to... Oh, excuse the cracks on this phone. Okay. As you can see, Alexa is currently um, connected to Erastus A12. 
so i can tell alexa to okay alexa please connect to my bluetooth called Searching. you're already connected to erastus's a12 to connect a different device go to the alexa app Okay, I just want to disconnect it. Now disconnected from Erastus's A12. Okay. Alexa, please connect to Ashla's Bluetooth. Searching. Maybe Debbie switched off her Bluetooth. Now connected to Erastus's A12. Okay, okay. You, you guys saw the gist of it. Doesn't necessarily have to be Ashla. I think she switched off her Bluetooth, but you can see she now just connected to Ashla. So you can either tell her to switch on or you can do it manually via the phone. Okay. Okay. So just a recap of what we did. We installed our smart switch, right? Once we did that, we now connected the smart switch to the Wi-Fi. And remember, we had to download Ewe Link to connect the smart switch to the Wi-Fi. Why Ewe Link? Because our smart switch is an Ewe Link product. We can have different type of products from different companies. You can have, you could have a smart switch from um, Amazon. There are also different other companies. But remember, if you have an Amazon product, then you don't have to download Ewe Link because you will find it directly into the um alexa app because remember alexa is an amazon product okay let's not get confused i hope we are all on the same page i'm schooling you guys like you know <laughs> i'll give it to you like i'm giving it to a five-year-old so that we are all on the same page and it's clear i know it's a bit confusing all right so um and then we also connected alexa to the wi-fi and i just explained how to do it if you didn't get it you are more than welcome to go back and understand it and remember guys if you guys want me to go into details like do everything from scratch step by step instead of just explaining let me know and i'll be glad to do that okay so now what we need to do is link the two devices to each other so that they are able to communicate with each other that's the ewe link switch that we have with alexa and we do that in the Alexa app. Alexa now will be able to call all the devices that are connected in your home. So if you, you can have a smart switch, a smart plug, a smart kettle, a smart bulb, a smart geezer, you know, all the things that you can have. We are now going to, we'll be able to see them in our Alexa app. That Remember, that's if it's another product ne? or another company that produced it. In this case, we link. If you had Amazon, then all this is not necessary. So, um, obviously, you need a smart switch, a smart bulb, a kettle, whatsoever. And Alexa will be able to call all those devices in the Alexa app. And then, you just classify that this is a switch for the kettle, this is a switch for the stove, and so on. It all depends on what devices that you have in your house. The way you can you the way you communicate with Alexa depends on how you have saved your device, the name you have saved your device. So let's say it can be switch number one or switch number two. You can say room number one or room number two or light number one and number number two or living room or sitting room. Depends. It all depends what you want. You just classify them the way you want, and I will show you shortly. So just keep watching. I hope it's not information overload. If it is. You can pause, rewind, watch again, or DM me for more information. In fact, if you want a detailed, like I said, I will do it for you guys. Um, so how you'll do that is you go to your Alexa app and then you go into devices. Once you go into devices, it's just that this one is not focusing. Okay, there we go. We have light here. You can press on light. And then you have, it's off right now, right? Oh, just forgive me, please. Because I'm only having two hands here. Um, you have off, right? It's off. I want to switch it on. Okay, so it's off, right? I'm going to try and switch it on. And there we go. The lights are on. I switch it off. That was for the inside. So this is the outside. We go back again here. And then the outside, I named it outside. Oh, sorry, it's not focused today. 
outside it's switch it off it's on i switched it on as you guys can see there and then i'll switch it off now okay and then <coughs> you can also say all lights on everything switches on or all lights off okay that's those are the lights you can also go to switches and then you say all on or all off that's the device all off come on switch off don't embarrass me okay um let me just focus a little bit there we go okay so we've passed that stage of connecting the two devices to each other which is the smart switch to alexa and um how we did that is connecting the wi-fi first to both devices and then we linked them together so that they can communicate okay cool so we have it off here yeah? now what we can do is hmm, this is my little setup so what we can do now also is i can tell alexa to switch on the light so remember we have three ways to switching it on via alexa telling alexa what to do or via the phone or doing it manually and we've tested both now we are going to test with alexa okay so that is the light i will tell alexa can you please switch on the lights in the sitting room there okay. we go alexa can you please switch off the light in the sitting room okay so when you talk to alexa she turns blue alexa that is Alexa. She turns blue. Okay, let me just show you guys the outside. Mm -hmm. You can communicate. Like, I can be in the room and Alexa can hear me, like, literally. So, this is the outside. I'll tell. Alexa, can you please switch on the lights in the... Oh, switch on the lights outside. There okay. she is. She switched it on. Alexa, please switch off the lights outside. Okay. Hmm. So, we have successfully installed alexa and the smart switch okay before we move on to the fire stick let's just add a few other features that alexa can do for us okay guys so um because i figured this video is actually too long i'm just going to show you guys a few features that alexa can do and then i'll create like a part two on um I'll create a part two on the fire stick and connecting the fire stick to the to the tv and connecting the fire stick to alexa or should i say connecting the fire stick to um alexa alexa keep quiet okay i don't know why she's speaking german whatever that language is anyways um sadly i just figured that spotify is not supported in namibia that's very unfortunate because then that means we cannot play music however these are okay you can see these are all the devices that you can add to alexa so you can have your lights your plug your switches your remote your camera your lock your garage i didn't even know that's possible um so much more like your tv a bluetooth speaker headphones microwave a coffee machine guys the possibilities are endless because i've never heard of some of these things a printer wow so yeah i'm sure a kettle a soap dispenser wow guys like the possibilities of alexa are endless like it's a lot of things alternatively i can also show you guys what i have in in my routines like here i've added just a couple of things um like uh for her to give us something positive for the morning like a positive mindset um motivation thing or when i say good night or night time then she maybe switches off all the light or when i say alexa good morning then she switches off, switches on all the lights um i also asked her to give me some news update like the daily stock market update or give me the question of the day or when i say alexa start my day and then she will probably read me the news on cnn you know um or uh read me the report or the weather for the day or the traffic like you can put in your location from your home to your traffic to your work and then she can always read you the traffic updates before you leave the house or the weather update 
and then um, to drink water whenever you cough. Like when she hears somebody coughing, then she'll remind you to drink water. And then um, if you, okay, you can also set up like if you have a baby sleeping and then the baby cries, she will let you know that now the baby's crying in the room or uh, for you to go check up on the baby because there's movements. Guys, it's, it's, it's amazing. It's really amazing. Or a morning ritual where she'll probably um, say some random a good phrase, a good morning phrase. Um, oh, like, guys, you can literally do whatever you want. Oh, this is other amazing, amazing feature. In communication, you can drop in. Dropping in is like uh, you are using Alexa like a, like a, how do you call this thing? Like an intercom. So I'm calling. So if you are not in the house, you can still you see that is alexa she's oh you can hear my voice that side let me just show you i i put alexa back because oh no oh no oh no there okay you see i just dropped in and uh i can hear myself through alexa so you can call using your phone or you can drop in how amazing right okay um let's hang up alternatively you can also you can also call you can also call or send a message or also you can create a shopping list you can guys the possibilities are endless but if you guys want me to um, create a video where I'm showing you guys exactly step by step of what to do let me know but remember i'm obviously limited to what i can do with alexa because i only have one smart device which is the smart switch but if you want to buy alexa and any other smart uh, devices to connect to alexa let do let me know you can dm me otherwise thank you guys so much for watching this video if you want to see how to connect the fire stick to the to the to the tv and i mean the fire stick to alexa and um um how that works out please watch the part two that's going to come after this video otherwise thank you guys so much for watching i appreciate your support um if you like alexa please uh go ahead and buy alexa and continue to buy the all the smart devices that you can um it's also quite sad that um I feel like some of the features of Alexa are not working properly. I'm sure they're working in other parts of the world except Africa, like Spotify. Spotify is not supported in Namibia. And if you ask her some questions around Namibia, she obviously doesn't know. And even to find your geographical location, if that's the word, um, it's a bit hard. So please, Amazon, come through for us, man. Uh, we love Alexa and we would love to, you know, explore all her features and uh, Spotify as well. Like we want to listen to music. Come on. But otherwise, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll, I'll catch you guys in my next video. Please, uh, if you have any questions, leave them down below or DM me and I'll be happy to get back to you guys. Thank you. Bye.